This video shows a minor oral surgical procedure named interdental gingival fibrectomy. This oral surgical procedure is to prevent the relapse of anterior interdental spacing after orthodontic correction. This surgical presentation is done by Dr. Praveen George Ticharia, BDS, Cosmopolitan Dental Clinic, Keke Road, Kotayam, Kerala, India. The phone number is 0481-258-0845. Mobile number is 9447317368. Email is cosmopolitan trust at hotmail.com. Even after the completion of orthodontic treatment for correction of anterior interdental spacing and after the continuous usage of removable retention appliances, the relapse is quite common. The reason for this relapse is due to the pressure exerted by the gingival fibers present as a thick band in the interdental area. Particularly these fibers are interpapillary fibers, transgingival fibers and intercircular fibers. Currently available treatment to prevent this relapse is continuous usage of retention appliances like holy supplants with label bow and finger springs by lingually bonded splinted retainers and phrenectomy and phrenotomy surgical procedures the instruments used mouth mirror curb explorer spoon excavator scissors number 12 bp blade and handle coming to the procedure anesthetize the canine to canine area by infiltration technique where the surgery has to be performed is interdental gingival fibrectomy. Interdental gingival fibrectomy is a minor oral surgical procedure to prevent the relapse of anterior interdental spacing after orthodontic correction. In this procedure, interdental gingival fibers like interpapillary fibers, intercircular fibers and transgingival fibers are being cut and removed to relieve the pressure exerted between the realigned teeth, preserving the normal anatomy and aesthetic appearance of labial and lingual papillas. The timing of this procedure. This procedure has to be done after the closure of anterior interdental spaces and prior to the removal of fixed orthodontic appliances. The fixed orthodontic forces has to be retained for a period of another two months for following reasons. To allow the complete bone formation around the bodily mood teeth, to minimize the scar formation, to confirm proximity of realigned teeth. Coming to the procedure, by using a suitable endospoon excavator, elevate the free marginal gingiva along the teeth on either side of the spacing. Hook around the interdental labial papilla, slightly extending it downwards so closely. Then incise the anterior end of the call with number 12 BP blade, preserving the normal anatomy and aesthetic appearance of labial papilla. Similarly, on the palatal or lingual aspects, the palatal mucosa along the tooth is elevated and hooked around the interdental lingual papilla. and the call is pulled out palately, carefully and completely without tear. This pulled out call area is excised using a sharp scissors preserving the normal anatomy and aesthetic appearance of the palatal papilla. Now 
we are seeing the excised portion of interdental call. Control the bleeding by hemostatic agents if required. Similarly, the same surgical procedure has to be performed in the other orthodontically closed anterior interdental spaces.
recall the patient after two days to tighten the elastic chain to confirm the proximity of the teeth. And after two months, the fixed orthodontic forces are removed and followed by scaling. The patient is given a removal retention appliance for a period of another one year. This procedure serves to prevent the relapse of anterior interdental spacing after orthodontic correction. Definitely, this surgical method is a better anti-relapse solution. Results are long-lasting and permanent.